They are rage. Brutal. Without mercy. But you, you will be worse. Rip and tear until it is done. We have to contain this. Cannot determine the cause of the demonic invasion until the Resop satellite is brought back online. Welcome. I'm Dr. Samuel Hayden. I'm the head of this facility. I think we can work together and resolve this problem in a way that benefits us both. <laughs> Cannot be allowed to leave this place. To ruin everything. I'm willing to take full responsibility for the horrible events of the last 24 hours, but you must understand. Our interest in their world was purely for the betterment of mankind. Everything has clearly gotten out of hand now, yes. But it was worth the risk. I assure you. Welcome to the UAC. Now 221 accident-free days. I believe in honesty. Especially now. In what will be your final moments in this world. All the rumors. The human sacrifices. The Hell Portal. The demons. It's all true. My sisters and brothers, be thankful. You will be the first. You will have a seat alongside them, just as I will, in what will become the new world that they create for us. Starting now.
Welcome to the UAC's Mars installation, located in the vast Alice Plain Impact Basin. This high-tech model and research facility is pushing the boundaries of the imagination each and every day. As a valued employee, your loyalty is more than just a commitment to the UAC. It's a commitment to the future of mankind. Thank you for your service. It's a gift. Take it. It will give you strength. Help you on your journey. If you can withstand the power surge. within the facility for you. Vega, give him what he wants. 61,337 UAC members deceased. 81% of the facility is on lockdown. Demonic presence through the Mars installation is critical. According to the records, Dr. Hayden, the invasion originated in the Lazarus facility. It seems that a hell wave was activated, transforming 64% of all UAC employees into the creatures you see roaming throughout the facility. The rest were killed by the demons released from their holding cells by Olivia Pierce. I feel I should apologize for what's happened here. Some of my employees took things too far. Olivia was the cause of all this, and I believe you We'll have to deal with her in time. You may not agree with our research, but know this. We exploited Hell and its resources because it was in mankind's best interest to do so. What you now see in this facility is the cost of progress. Huh. But none of that matters now. There is an emergency in the Foundry. The regulators have been destroyed, and the core temperatures are now destabilizing. They've overrun the adjacent facility. If the venting turbines aren't re-engaged, neither of us will survive the meltdown. Authorization, Olivia Pierce, Alpha 4, zero, 2. She has locked me out, Dr. Hayden. All power reloaded to Argent Energy Tower. She is trying to tear open the portal between our world and theirs. You could not have saved them anyway. The system won't allow anyone but Olivia to override it now. We will have to shut down the Argent Tower manually from the surface. Olivia is using the tower to drill a doorway into their world. You can prevent her from opening the gate by disabling the tower induction filters. Untethered cross-dimensional activity is a frequent occurrence outside of the base, so it is recommended that workers buddy up when journeying onto the Martian surface. We are only 
temporarily disabling the tower. You need to remove each lens individually. Carefully release the hinges. Warning. Energy contamination detected. Destroying the production of Argent energy isn't necessary. The Hell Energy is unusable without the filters! Warning. Energy what you are destroying energy. is more valuable than you can possibly imagine. It is a perfect and unlimited energy resource. We spent decades perfecting the science, selling it to humanity. We balanced their hell energy with our science, making it usable and safe. We solved an energy crisis the world had no answer for. It works. You cannot do this. Energy production is what you want, then you need only to destroy this last filter, and Argent Energy will no longer exist in this solar system. We will be back at square one. is still alive. I've detected her life signature at the Argent Tower. She has removed one of the accumulators from the tower base. It has a unique energy signature that we can track. Well, that's it then. There's nothing else to be done. Primary access points to the tower were destroyed in the explosion. The pipeline is damaged, but still intact. There are thrust boots in the maintenance hangar. You can use them to traverse the pipeline. Demonic presence at top safe level. Lockdown in effect. Choose. 
Lantern Tower is destroyed. The portal can no longer be closed from this side. The Hell Energy flows from a location in their world we call the Well. But you've returned. The only flesh and blood to walk between dimensions. <laughs> so there may be a way. Vega is trying to access Olivia's files. If you can get to the nearest terminal, we will provide you with information. That's all for now. Olivia has an artifact in her private lab that we've been studying for years. I believe you can use it to find the answers you seek. It bears your mark. Olivia's personal laboratory is not part of the registered facilities database. Alpha level clearance will be required to locate it. Granted. You can access her Lazarus facility from the north sector of the advanced research complex, about 80 kilometers away. I'll bring the tram power online to take you there, but you'll need a UAC corporate facilities clearance card to activate it. There is a security station nearby. Those who came before you, and those with whom you serve, all operate with the same goal in mind, the development of a new dawn for men. cannot send a team in to retrieve it. I am the head of this corporation. All your work and discoveries here belong to me. He was mine before you even found him. UAC Tramline, ready for departure. Please be seated. The tram is now ready to depart. The UAC's Advanced Research Complex will be our final destination. Now approaching UAC Advanced Research Complex. It's time we meet in person. My office is on the second floor of this facility. This vast state-of-the-art research, design, and production center uses cutting-edge technology and fabrication techniques to prototype everything from robotics to weaponry to subspace communication systems. We are not advancing enough applicants and our faith is nothing without believers. We cannot conduct our work without them. And what kind of work is it that you're doing, Olivia? I haven't seen a report from your team in months now, have I? Can I trust that you can maintain your distance and control of the situation? Of course. I believe in our work. But in order to make progress, we will have to make even greater sacrifices. This isn't progress, it's madness. The board understands the peculiar nature of your work and no one is in the dark on what those sacrifices mean to mankind. But your judgment is no longer considered sound. Do 
not be alarmed by the system update. It is a prototype of our interdimensional tether. A means for me to pull you back from hell. I'm sorry for the... jolt. But I didn't think you'd allow its installation voluntarily. I'm Dr. Samuel Hayden. I have supplies in my office. This way, please. The destruction of the Argent Tower is... devastating. But... I am committed to helping you close the portal. All of our work and understanding of their world is derived from the inscriptions on a large stone artifact we pulled from Hell in the earliest days of the program. We call it the Helix Stone. It is our most closely guarded asset. Olivia was obsessed with it. From it, we learned how to manipulate Hell's energy, bend it to our will take advantage of their resources. It also led us to you. The Helix Stone showed us how to harness the power of the well. I believe it will show you how to shut it down. For years, Olivia has kept the Helix in her private office in the Lazarus Labs, which is only accessible through a secure elevator from the advanced research complex across the chasm. Your affinity for guns is apparent. I'm confident you'll find something useful there as well. The service elevator is at the end of the hall. Find the Helix Stone in Olivia's private archival lab deep within this facility. Few have ever seen the stone. But if you came to us for a reason, you might be able to see something in it we haven't. It is not a mistake that he has come into our possession. The demons prophesized his return. If he awakes, it could jeopardize the entire mission, for he is the only one who can stand against them. Volunteers are currently needed for the UAC's exciting new Revenant research program. Expand your potential, experience something new, and go beyond mere mortal limitations. See Jessica and Human Resources to find out if you qualify. Olivia activated the Hell Wave from somewhere inside this facility. I did hope she could rise above their influence. I was wrong. She proved to be weaker than I thought she'd be. You should not have allowed his location to be discovered. You have failed us. It was not me. It was Samuel. He led them to his tomb. Please. We can overcome this. I promise. The gate will be opened as planned.
That's what she was looking for. Vegan, did you get the location? Yes. It is located in an uncharted region of the Titan's realm, but we'll need to rupture another Argent accumulator to create the portal. The only accumulator in this sector is in specimen CD-587. <laughs> You're going to have to remove it. Once you've extracted the accumulator, it will become unstable. The ruptured casing should cause a rift strong enough to send you back to their world. We can determine your point of entry using the tether system I uploaded to your suit. Retrieving the crucible is critical. Without it, we have no way of shutting down the well and closing the hell portal here on Mars. Redirect the course of mankind. On this day, we make our contribution to their cause. Our salvation lies with them. I pulled you from that tomb in the Cadenger Sanctum for this reason. I know she was weak. Our work doesn't come without risks. And I released you from your prison to help mitigate those risks. I knew that in the event of a catastrophe, you'd be the only thing that could stop them. Accumulator powering the Cyber Demon. Destabilizing the core will cause a rift that will send you back to hell. Once the Crucible is in your possession, we will pull you out. me so much.
You've won. It's over. You stopped the invasion and closed the portal. But it's come at a price. Argent. Vega. This entire operation. You see, I've watched you work. Come to understand your motivation. You think the only way is to kill them all, leave nothing behind. Then you may be right. But we can't just shut it all down. Without Argent Energy, it will be worse. I don't expect you to agree. But with this, we can continue our work. I am not the villain in this story. I do what I do because there is no choice. Rerouting tether coordinates complete. Our time is up. I can't kill you, but I won't have you standing in our way. Until we see each other again.